first and foremost, I want to say, Kalalak, I want to show you how to do it. to the elders and apostles of Graven Stone. And salutations to all the brothers in the highways. I'm doing this work in sincerity and in truth. Right, the Hebrew Israelites come out here week in, week out, in season, out of season, prophesy the downfall of this wicked system and preach unto the gathering of the elect men. Sin, to get giant unto the coming of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. Right? The nation of Israel from Judah and down, you people are the nation of Israel was brought over here throughout the transatlantic slave trade. So come forth, the most I set up in profits to come forth to teach you people that. Because contrary to popular belief, the so-called white man, child Edomites, would have you believe that you are, you are, you are African Americans. For you to seek repatriation from them, to seek freedom from them. But you are not African Americans, man. You are the children of the most I. Yasha Allah, the prince of the poem. So come out here to declare that truth unto you. To take off the veil that's cut off the covering veil. To take off the covering veil off of the eyes of your people, for who that will receive it. Because most of our people now, they're blind. And they're going blind until the time of, of, of vengeance, when the Mosai will be killed to turn on your people. Because the thing is that you trust now the master so much that even though the truth come out here blatantly and fox and archaeological evidence that you have identified your people, your people don't want to see the white truth, you know? Right? What? Isaiah 25 verse 7 And he will destroy in this mountain the face of the covering cast over all people and the veil that is spread over all nations. Which is right now, man. Most say you destroy the covering that is cast of all people, merely the lack of the nation of Israel, because two thirds do not receive the truth. Two thirds of all people condemn the death and destruction, man. They are the ones that was born in vain. So the most says through the prophets, I, cut, I, I destroy the covering that was cast of all people. Even the people, know, most of the people over in, in the Middle East, they know who are the true Israelites right now. On the internet, they have crackers who start to speak, who, are, who start to identify, say, yo, the blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans are the two Israelites that the Bible talk about, yo. Right? We are the last tribe of the house of Israel, yo. So, so right now, right now, we're out here prophesying to you people for sure, you people are true heritage, man. You see? Because Esau would have you believe. For, for basically, was three of a multiple different philosophies where him set up to basically re misdirect the truth. Because he saw set up Muslim, is him, is him, um, funnel Rastafarianism, is him, um, set up Roman Catholic and and all of them things, amen. Why? Because he wants to distort the truth, man. He don't want to need the nation of Israel to return to them right position. Because the scriptures say, oh, Esau is the end of the world and Jacob is the beginning thereof. Why? Why? He would have wanted to just tell him to say, oh, look here, you people are the chosen people of heavenly father. Why would I come out and just say, play to this? Right? Right now, when the, when the, when the sword dumb, the stuck and stuck in. See? All people stuck and stupid that Esau do certain movies where I'm telling the people, say, oh, we are the, the last tribe of Israel, man. You see? Because they have a movie that was produced back in the 90s. Um, the name can't come to mind right now. But within that, within that series, they must show and say, yo, the, 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 the series has shown me to a little clip, say, yo, the, uh, the Native Americans, blacks and Latinos, are the last tribe of house of Israel. Certain long time, um, um, cowboy movies show him that man. A lot of movies where the Native American Indians. Cut. Yeah, the blacks are uh, the other side. Cut. Yeah, but the Native American Indians, the uh, Latinos, the Latinos, the Romans, the Hispanics, the name. Those people are those um, Indians. South, uh, South America, um, North America, Central America, 
you know, it does afterwards when the black Negroes, so called Negroes, come over. Yeah, but the last tribe was, is uh, the last tribe of the outside Israel is considered to be from Ephraim, Ephraim and Dogs. And, and the
It's only a man with spiritual eyes can see it. Because we go to work, we go to work for two weeks and get money by the end of two weeks. It's a sin now. It's a transgression of the law because the law tells you it's enough to get um, gold back a man wages to the man in Africa. Right? But guess what? No. Them are hold, them right now, they are hold back your wages. If you just get a first job, them can hold your wages out a month in the back. Which means that they will not pay you until the second month of work. You can't see the rubber in the And then, it's like say, yo, all people now have no complaint. They just say, ah, yo, yeah, they come on, I saw life, but you know that. complain about the wrong things. They complain about the wrong things, yo. They complain about how, about how um, that girl and I give me the pussy. But oh, the girl of all life say yo, oh, our man better than me. No complain about being funny, yo. You see it? Uh, this is Jeremiah 2, chapter 2, verse 11. And the nation changed their gods, which are yet no gods. But my people have changed their glory for that which do it not profit. God. God. Also being slaves, so people strode being slaves to uh, Esau, which our true glory is actually being rulers over all these other nations. You see, me and glory of people, um, glory right now in the prophet because look on them, it show you. You see, me show you saying the prophet, our glory, our will be servants of the Algoa Shemi which I turn back to power and rule over the other nations, yeah, with a rather higher. Sure. Like, like, um Verse 12. Be astonished, O oh, ye heavens, at this. Be horribly afraid. Be very, be very desolate, say the Lord. For my people are committed to evil. They have forsaken me at the fountain of living waters. Forsake the fountain of living waters. The one who tried to orchestrate the world in the order man, who will give you everything alright. Right. Yes, exactly. Who will give you everything of uh, man over your way in this life man, and orchestrate everything in a perfect order. Because the scripture tells us that the laws of the most are perfect. They are perfect. They don't need to add or take away nothing from it. Of course, there is early to um, be, for instance, in um, dealing with a woman, you see me dealing with a daughter. The scripture tells us straight, so you're supposed to keep them in straight. You see me, and then when they reach up a marital age, you, know, you promise them over and to a son we see um, fit, you see me, or a son of Israel, so you clarify that. We see fit, you know, nowadays you have this woman, they go to school, you know, they mix with all sorts of other men, and they mingle and get naughty and pollute themselves. And destroy themselves, but the scripture give you a plain guideline. Hope they actually deal with everything. You see me? But the people don't want to follow the scriptures. They don't want to do the Lord. That's why they must take the most of it. And they wonder why they have a baby father who will be a scholar and take care of it. They wonder why, why a man just breed them, left them. Being dumb, being stupid. Mm -hmm. It's a new demote cistern, broken cistern that can hold no water. Is Israel a servant? Is he a woman slave? Why is this why? You people they can customs which is similar which is a similar cistern, See which cannot own the water. What is a cistern? Cistern is somewhere somewhere all uh, the, the, the waste and the trash to run through. See the 
shit up the system, up the system. That you know, um, you are to do yourself, you know. 